Hello everyone. In today's video I break down a recent report on an attack by an attacking group called Scarlet Eel on AWS Cloud. As usual, you can find the link to the report in the description of the video. Initial access of the attacker was possible via a publicly available Kubernetes cluster which could be exploited for remote shell execution. The attacker was able to compromise this cluster and first installed a crypto miner on the system. But the attacker did not stop there. He continued to look around and was able to steal credentials that were directly accessible via IMDS version 1, which is used to configure machines. The attacker could now use these short-term credentials in order to try to become persistent on the victim's cloud. Fortunately, the user's rights were not privileged enough for the attacker to succeed. However, the attacker stumbled upon a misconfiguration on the user he was impersonating. The user had extensive read permissions, which allowed the attacker to read everything in the account, including AWS Lambda, which is used for serverless computing service, which permits the direct execution of code written in different programming languages. The attacker found some software within Lambda and the associated keys to run it. As is usual in the kill chain, the attacker also deleted logs in order to mitigate the defensive capabilities. The attacker was also able to access further parts of the compromised cloud. But I will not go into too much detail here. You can read the report in the description if you are interested. In conclusion, patching your systems and using IMDS version 2 would have prevented the stealing of credentials. Also, some administrators falsely believe that read-only access rights grant 100% security, but as we have seen, this is not the case. That concludes today's short video on another preventable attack. See you in the next.